Hello friends, myself Chirak Balodia. Today I am going to teach you types of delay in computer network. Uh, there are main four types of delay. Processing delay, queuing delay, transmission delay and propagation delay. See all the types in detail. First one, processing delay. Processing delay is a nodal delay. Uh, it defines time required to examining the packet header. It means check the packet header where to packet will be sent from one node to another and determining where to direct the packet. Now see over here in this figure, uh, if uh, one packet comes from B to A, now A, uh, A will check the header of packet and send uh, either PC upper or lower PC. So it is called processing delay. Now you can check over here, this is the processing delay. So it means there is a process of examining the header. Next one, queuing delay. After nodal processing delay, the router directs the packet to the queue that precedes the link to subsequent router. The queuing delay is denoted by DQ. Uh, in this figure, you can show that uh, there is a uh, total four packets are shown uh, over here. The one packet is going from A to B and another packet, uh, remaining another packets are in waiting. So it is called, uh, these three packets are in queuing delay. Uh, sometimes queuing delay will be zero. If there is uh, no queue at router and packet comes from uh, one router to another router so there is uh, uh, queuing delay is zero the queuing delay is observed at the queue the packet experiences a queuing delay as it waits to be transmitted over the link so this is the queuing delay next one transmission delay the transmission delay is defined as the amount of time required to transmit all the packet bits over the link uh, it is also called store and forward delay so now you can check uh, in this figure this is the transmission delay so it means uh, all the packet bits uh, comes from output port of the router to communication channel so it is called transmission delay next one propagation delay the propagation delay is defined as time required by a packet to propagate from sender to receiver so now you can check that this is the propagation delay so if uh, one packet comes from uh, router a to router b so when packet will reach this time is called propagation delay the propagation delay is denoted by d propagation now total nodal delay the all the delays uh, it means uh, processing delay queuing delay transmission delay and propagation delay that all are uh, combined and it generates total nodal delay so this is the equation you can see over here Thank you for watching video. Please like, share and comment on all videos. Subscribe my channel on YouTube Chirak Balodia. Please press the bell icon for the new video uh, notification. Thank you. Thank you so much.